what's up everybody welcome back to exotic gas lodge again and great to see you finally i'm back to germany after 18 days of my trip to the holy lands my place gohati and finally here i am again in germany so i will start making the videos again i didn't make a uh, much uh, big videos there when i was in india because the internet connection is very slow and to upload a video of 2 gb it was taking me roughly uh, four to five hours so my apologies for the delays okay so but i uploaded many example charts so i hope um, many of you would get a gist of uh, how to approach uh, the charts when you see yes that's what i did i took some topics and uh, for every topic i did some charts and i will be doing more of that also in the future okay so today's video is a bit different it is not an astrology today's video is on 10 signs that you are doing fantastic in life even if you feel as if you are not doing okay so what are 10 signs that you are actually doing yourself very great which means you may not get the results but you are trying your best yes what are such 10 signs so we will discuss about about them today here and if you are new to the channel and you have not yet subscribed then please subscribe to it somewhere here there and if you want a consultation then approach me through my website below and then if you like this video which i am very sure you would like it then please click the thumbs up and share it with somebody who wants to know if they are doing good great or fantastic but if some of these symptoms or some of these signs or some of these indications some of these 10 points are there in your life which i'm very sure will be then i'm rest assured that you are doing fantastic yes the results may come or it may not come because lord krishna says in the bhagavad gita that karma neva dhikaraste ma faleshu kadachana that you can only do your part yes you cannot get the results as you desire you may get that or you may you may not get that that is on my hands okay so you focus on doing not on the results so that's what lord krishna is telling so we have to do our duty and whatever is there in our destiny and whatever god wills that will anyways happen okay so this video will give us 10 indications of things that we are trying our best to make it happen okay so what's the first sign the first sign is everything seems to be falling apart oh my god <laughs> nothing is working and yes before i begin as i always say god is there with you all the time just look to him and you will find him the sun is shining beautifully today here in gottingen all right so the first symptom is everything seems to be falling apart my god everything is falling into pieces I've had a breakup recently. I was fired from job. I could not clear this exam. Oh my God. I have a terrible relationship with my mother. I have a terrible relationship with my father. My girlfriend is not listening. My boyfriend is not replying. My God. Everything seems to be over. <laughs> if you feel that everything is collapsing and you are not able to do anything. Yes. Then it means you are doing fantastic because you are trying your best to make things happen. Yes. Because we are talking of actions here. We are not talking of the results. The results may come or the results may not come. But if everything seems to be falling apart, even after you try, then it means you are doing fantastic because you are at your best. You are doing everything to make the uh, ends meet. Yes, so that's the first symptom. So if you feel that nothing is going the way you want, after you are trying, then don't worry. Hold on. Hang on. Keep doing. It will happen. Okay. What's the next thing? ah this is beautiful you realize that you will always be a student yes because you understand that life is not uh, as you as they say rome was not built in a day so life is not uh, like a candle that you put fire and then it's over after some time yes so it's a gradual process of learning every day you are learning from new new people new new experiences so every day you are learning from the everyday experiences of life for example, suppose you go out, uh, then you see a beggar, you see that the beggar is struggling, the beggar doesn't have money or the beggar doesn't have food to eat, the beggar doesn't have a home. And then when you come home, you see that you have this big plasma LCD LED TV and then you feel, oh my goodness, I'm so lucky. <laughs> the beggar doesn't have anything to eat or anything to live Yes, in, but I have this big LCD LED plasma TV. I'm so fortunate. So 
you try to learn from every experience of your life yes your eyes are not like the eyes of a materialistic person you develop shastra chakshu which is the eye of the scriptures shastra is scriptures and chakshu refers to eyes so shastra chakshu means you develop the eye of the scripture which means anything you see you don't see you see through the eye of the scripture so whenever you see somebody who is less fortunate than you you feel very happy about yourself yes because you feel grateful yes or suppose your boss scolds you then you don't go and uh, bitch about him or her to your friends or colleagues yes you try to learn uh, you try to understand why that person why your boss your superior he or she scolded you maybe you did something wrong or maybe you didn't do as it was expected so you don't complain you just try to learn from everything yes you re- you understand that you will remain a student lifelong forever you will always remain a student so that's the second sign that you are doing fantastic because you are trying your best to make life a learning experience yes rather than complaining what's the third thing third sign that you are doing fantastic in life people say that you are a source of inspiration to them oh yes and by the way uh, these are the things which i have uh, noted myself from my experience so so this is not copied from anywhere maybe some places here there but i have tried to summarize it whatever i know so the third thing is people say that you are a source of inspiration to them which means people people when they see you they feel oh yes 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 he is the one she is the one i also want to be like you <laughs> so if people tell you that my dear sir my dear madam you are my inspiration you are my hero i want to be like you if somebody asks me who do you want to be like then you say i want to be like that person then you are doing fantastic in life <laughs> because as they say that uh, i would say this in hindi uh, as they say that jab uh, kisi ke sang se aapke vicharon mein parivartan aane lage to samajh lijiye ki aap you are staying with an extraordinary person which means that when uh, you, you when the association of somebody affects you so strongly that you feel like changing yourself internally changing doesn't mean uh, changing uh, your behavior but improving yourself basically then it means that you are staying in a very strong company yes that person is driving you completely to improve yourself so then uh, you are uh, doing fantastic in life because when people see you your achievements your accomplishments or just the way you are sometimes yes not your achievements and accomplishments but just the way you are sometimes so when people see you or they observe you then they feel that yes 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 this person is a hope this person is a role model if people come and tell you like that then you are doing fantastic in life yes so what's the fourth sign that you are doing fantastic people will come and ask you how did you get so far itna dur kaise pahunche because people have faith in your journey yes that means you are doing fantastic people want to know how you reached that far from the beginning because people have seen your journey from the beginning yes suppose uh, you uh, started some spiritual practice and you started with some mantras but you were not doing it initially you were reluctant yes just like a neophyte sadhu or a neophyte yogi you just started you just kicked off something and then uh, you were just living uh, amongst the materialistic crowd yes but then suddenly one day something happens and you decide oh no my god that's it i have to become serious now yes because god is teaching me some lessons here maybe i had a breakup <laughs> just uh, just on a light and not so then what happens you take up your spiritual commitments very seriously yes and then people see that you have changed drastically my god the level of change is like it's paradoxical it's beyond human comprehension so then people will come and tell you sir 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 madam please tell me you were here and now you are there how did it happen please tell me yes so what's the fifth thing that uh shows you are doing fantastic in life you feel there is something wrong or missing even after you put all your efforts yes you feel that oh i could have done this much better yes especially this is true with our spiritual practices because we can never say that we have perfectly chanted a mantra yes we can never say at least i cannot say that so uh, if we feel that we are uh, doing everything but still we could have done it bit more then that shows 
uh, our attention to details because uh, my guru maharaj he says uh, attention to details is a sign of love so if a boy is in love with a girl or a girl is in love with a boy then they will ensure that suppose if there's valentine's day you know, then uh, they will ensure that i give them the best possible rose yes so they will pay uh, so much attention to the details yes what's the color of the rose how how what's the smell of the rose yes how's the composition is is it today's or is it yesterday's yes or is it plucked just now yes so attention to details this is another indication that you are doing fantastic in life and you have done everything but still you feel yes i could have done something much better than this or a bit more yes i could have done so you are happy with your uh, achievements but still you have that quest yes 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 something else could have been better in this and you don't get disheartened because of that but you uh, feel a healthy sense of um, accomplishment and you feel that i could have done this much better so next time when i do it i will do it a bit better than this yes so that's the next sign that you are doing fantastic in life what's the next thing that shows you are doing fantastic the sixth point you realize that some things can never be changed yes 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 sometimes you have to let go of certain things you have to realize that you are not in control yes lord krishna says i am the controller surada sarva bhutanam gyatva mam shanti mruchati one who realizes i am that i am the controller enjoyer and proprietor of everything that person becomes happy because again lord krishna also says brahma bhuta prasanna atma na sochati na kankshati sama sarveshu bhuteshu mad bhaktim labhate param when one is peaceful that means when one's mind is calm that time he can see the spiritual truths as it is before that we are just simply hovering around our materialistic plane as shrimad bhagavatam says says manorathe na sati dhavato bahi halav bhaktasya kuto mahad guna all right so you realize that sometimes some things cannot be changed yes which means suppose you have tried your best but still your boss is not happy with you so then you realize anyways i can't do anything <laughs> that that should only happen after you have tried your best yes so if you feel that that's happening that you realize that i have tried my best but still it's not happening then you understand that you are doing fantastic because you have tried everything yes and this is not the uh, dictum of procrastination or laziness that oh anyways i can't do anything now anyways i can't change anything so what's the use no this is not like that this is after you have tried and you realize that i can't do it man it's not possible <laughs> maybe that's not for me <laughs> maybe it's time that i walk away from it yes or maybe it's time that i let things be as it is for some time for the time being let's not try to change things yes so that shows you are doing fantastic because sometimes or rather many times things are not in our control you don't get disappointed if the bus is late or if uh the train didn't arrive yes sometimes it happens so you realize that everybody has their own flaws everybody has their own challenges and it's not necessary that everything goes the way we want so we get that maturity that sometimes things may not go as we want so then it shows that we are doing fantastic in life because we are gaining maturity that's very important in life all right so what's the seventh thing ah this is very important you visualize yourself making it happen yes 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 so for somebody wants to be a film star he is uh, visualizing yes he or she is thinking yes 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 today i'm just uh, singing but nobody is listening to me today i'm acting but hardly 100 people are watching me but i know one day when i will sing or when i will act there will be millions of people he visualizes himself he is standing in front of a crowd and the crowd is going crazy for that person yes they are screaming howling dancing giggling jumping <laughs> to see you you are visualizing yourself like that if you are doing that and if you are able to do it that means you are doing fantastic in life because you are seeing that things are happening slowly 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 it's not happening the way you want or it's not happening to that level but very soon it is going to happen yes very soon you know that you are going to make it big you are not somebody who is going to settle for anything less but you are going to make it big this time so if you visualize that yes 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 after 10 years i will have 
uh, I will achieve this and you visualize yourself suppose you want to become very rich then you visualize you are sitting somewhere in the Bahamas or in, du- uh, in uh, Dubai or somewhere I don't know some uh, rich place and you are rejoicing in the uh, in the beautiful places like in the heavens then understand that you are doing fantastic because you are able to visualize what you want yes and then you go into the law of attraction what you visualize that becomes your uh, uh, programming standard uh, programming and then you act accordingly yes so then that is another symptom that you are doing fantastic because now you are seeing slowly 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 your dreams are becoming reality may not be at once but it's happening so you know now i'm here after two years i'll be here after five years i'll be there and after 10 years somewhere maybe (laughs) what's the uh, eighth thing that shows you are doing fantastic in life you let go of the quest for perfection yes you understand that uh, things need not become perfect <laughs> which means you know that things will never be perfect yes because uh, as they say there is only one person who is perfect that is God because Lord Ram is known as Mariada Purushottam he is the only perfect person that can exist yes I mean I, I'm giving Lord Ram's example because many of us know him uh, from the Indian traditions but we have to understand that whoever is there they will never be perfect yes Neither will we be perfect. Neither will uh, the person with whom we are staying, will they be perfect. And we don't need to be perfect also. Yes, we don't need to be uh, too good actually sometimes. Sometimes we just need to be ourselves. So if we understand that things may not be 100% and we don't become disappointed at it, then it shows that we are doing fantastic in life because we learn to accept things for what they are. We learn to accept people for who they are and not try to change them or control them. Now, what's the ninth thing that shows you are doing fantastic in life? The ninth thing is, people tell you that you will make it big one day. Yes, yes, yes. People are telling you, sir, madam, one day you will reach there. Yes, yes, yes. If that is happening, then you are definitely going to make it big one day you are definitely doing fantastic because not only you are visualizing now other people around you they are also visualizing and they are also telling you yes that sir you are going to make it big yes if you are in youtube suppose somebody says to you that oh you are very soon going to have a million subscriber or if suppose uh, you are running into uh, politics then somebody says you will become the prime minister of India one day okay, or you will become the president of United States one day so if people are telling you that you will make it big someday or very soon or in the near future then understand that you are doing fantastic because now everybody else is gaining faith in you everybody else knows only time is separating you are going to make it very big alright and what's the last thing I'll switch off my mobile here. So the last thing that you are doing great, fantastic, beautiful, benevolent, wonderful, too good is you get a good sleep in the night. Okay. <laughs> you are able to sleep peacefully because you have utilized your day properly. And now when you go to the bed, you are left with zero energy. Yes. You are feeling as if you are going to die if you don't sleep because you have exhausted yourself fully that means you exerted yourself to 100,000 percent and then you don't have any energy in the night when you come and rest in your bed okay there's no time for gossip or there's no time for watching the tv there's no time for doing unnecessary drama and you are like i want to sleep now and tomorrow morning i want to get up and i want to jet set go again yes so that's it from my side 10 signs that you are doing fantastic, great, wonderful, all right. So, I will uh, post these things below in the description so that if you want to know uh, in a bird's eye view, you can have a look at them, okay. So, that is it from my side. Thank you very much for listening for so long as usual. And if you're new to the channel and you have not yet subscribed, then please subscribe to it somewhere here, there below. And if you want a consultation, then please approach me to my website. The description uh, is there below or if you want to approach me through my phone number or mail that is also there below and if you like this video which i'm very sure you would have liked then click the thumbs up and share it with somebody who you have seen that they are doing everything but still it's not happening so tell them that sir hold on madam 
patience you will make it big one day okay so that's it from my side wish you good luck and remember that even if you're trying things are not happening then god is there with you all the time just look to him and you will definitely for sure very well find him okay until next time bye bye see you